There are some laws of life you can't transgress. Speak in tongues if you want to and sing all the Bill Gaither songs while you go down the highway and run a four-way stop. And when you get killed, it won't be the devil. It's because while you were spiritual, you were not practical. You'll sing all the way into heaven because God operates both parallel in life and in the spirit by the laws of life, by the laws of his word. Pastor, why does our world seem to be on fire? It seems to be as if it's on a one-way street of, 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 of degradation, of, of dissemination. What in the world is going on? It's when we disregard the laws of God, the Word of God, the words of God, the instruction of God. At that moment, we're saying to God, I know more than you do. I can fly this plane on my own. I don't need your help getting to where I need to be. But don't be so cocky. Because life has a way with its circumstance of readjusting your false perception. How many understand that if you won't fall on the rock being Jesus Christ and his word in humility and become broken in humbleness, that you walk that path long enough in pride, you no longer will fall on the rock, but you will have signed up for the rock to fall on you. And instead of being broken, you then become crushed. Either way, you're going to live out of your brokenness. It just is, it's just a matter of which you determine to be broken by. Either you can fall on the rock in humility or you can let the rock fall on you in pride. Both brings a crushing, but out of them, God can use them. Somebody say, man, if you believe that. 